laid it off the boards, came right back for Verhage. Carter Verhage scores! Oh, Lafreniere tipped it into his own net. The center of this spot, McKeever, drag level. Oh, did you see that? She loves oh, absolute Rubbery. We talk about a desperation save. It, the amount of real estate that Shelov's had to get back to. Chipped all the way. And tape to tape. Here's Lindgren. Backhander. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. just saved the goal. Can you believe it? What an effort from Jordan Lund. Man, do they ever look like they're struggling in the power play. Could it be any worse? A shorthanded goal on a giveaway. From Schneider, shorthanded goal for Connor Brown. Oh my goodness, that was a gong show. Verhege gets dumped by Carlo. It's a great come on, scores! Loves a pass. Sagan's on it. Here he is. Stopped by Hill. The rebound. Stopped again. The third chance is wrong. Hayden Hill comes up big on Sagan. After Dodonov had a beauty of an opportunity. Period. A lot of confidence by keeping the puck. Make a stone through center. Stevenson a step. Stevenson's in. Stopped by Ottinger. What a save by Ottinger. Period. Carlson with some rule. Moves it and shoots. Pilato. Out in front. Pacioretty stopped. I don't know how that stayed out of the net. There's tremendous flexibility and athleticism by Chester. Wow. Now Hintz. Hayskin in. Great save. Two great stops by Logan Thompson. This one's outstanding. This one even better. Can't get it to the net. Nylander to the net. Nylander's on it. William Nylander cross. Oh, it bang. Off. Witherspoon and Swayman. Oh. One last stop before the horn. What a save that was. Off the skate in the slot as William Nylander no leaves it off for Pavelski. Pavelski across. Oh, Georgiev again on Sagan. Uh, Sagan is uh, if, if he's a left shot. This and here's Corey Perry trying to break through. A chance in front and in scores. Or is it Perry celebrating? Stick in the air. The puck in the mesh of the glove to tell if that's over the line or not. Yeah, look at the double clutch there by Shilovs to be able to find that one. Hironik is getting a penalty regardless, or if this is a goal, the penalty won't be. And fans are watching it. It's a hard one to look from that angle to see definitively. The call, it looks... After a video review of the call, the ice is confirmed. No goal. JT Miller. Drop best for Deeds. Stop it. You know, walking in, stop rebound, back save. He'll come back, tipped in, and oh, what a stop! Matt Murray, sensational. Oftentimes, the problems start all the way in the offensive zone when you see a breakdown like this. Everyone's magnetic to the puck. Every Does not connect. Uh, good idea by Paul. Oh. Crazy bounce and Pasternak is the beneficiary. Big players doing that this morning. Well, certainly going to pay off for the Boston Bruins. I mean, Hellebuck's been unbelievable given the opportunities Boston has had when they've had their opportunity. He drops one. Strom with a setup. Gets a return. Strom walks it in. His shot. The flex on that score. A fortunate bounce for Washington. And offensive zone shift, they they bring the forward high. Oshie had come up earlier, now it's Strom up at the point. Where are the defensemen? They're down by the net. It's opportunity for the Devils, who race right back in. Mercer to the forehead! Oh. Score! Dawson Mercer second! It's three in a row for the Devils, who lead on the road. Dawson Mercer. Get off the bench press. You're taking it strong to the game. It's Alex Stalock with the paddle. Oh, my. Paddle Pozo couldn't quite knock it in. Crosby and Sherry back the other way. Crosby backhand scores. Good work. Kane dancing in. Kane scores. What a goal by Pat 
Patrick Kane! It could be all your fault. It might be. Here's a bouncing puck in front, Crosby! Bats out of the air, and we're all tied up! Center ice, it's Patrick Kane in Chicago! Oh, no. oh my God! Kane with the overtime winner! The Red Wings win it 3-2! to two. The story is complete on Kane's return! Hagee, back for Barkov. In front, and they score right hard again. Watch him get knocked down, stay with it, right here, and then... He juggles it and, on the stick. And then goes across, and as he's going down, still makes that pass. That is unbelievable. Hughes swings in off the left side, goes all the way up. Smith, nice tap pass for Malkin. Fires, score! Well, that looked like Gino. And you can see early they wanted to go to him right here. But it was elected for that top pass. And there's an assist for Riley Smith as well on that little touch. Flyers and Devils surpassed by what these teams have done. Free puck, Panarin! And it's in the net with a count! It crossed the line, but the net was off! And the officials are going to talk about it. Rangers come flying off the bench to celebrate. They think they've won, but there has been no definitive signal yet. After review, we have a good goal on the ice. Byfield quickly to center ice. With speed, Byfield around one man in on goal. Scores! What a goal! Out is Yoki Haru in behind the net. Skinner up for, for Thompson! Did that go over the line or is that a glove save to highlight by Gibson? No, no call by the referee on the ice and Gibson himself down and I think it's going to be a save here. Here's Skinner throws this one to the front of the net and there it is. Right at the post. Right at the post, right at the line. Brazo, he's got Bocas going to the net. There's the pass. He beats and he scores. The opening goal of the game goes to Jesper Boquist. Set up by him. Pass just behind Kreider. And now Zaboro picks it up for the Bruins. Man, has Kreider been moving here in this game? I don't know why Tuka Ross has a net. Yeah, why did he go to the bench? <laughs> I'm convinced he must have thought there was a delayed penalty. And the bench is like, Tuka, get back. <laughs> They're like, get back. Having to laugh about it after he started to head to the bench. Ross <laughs> Wheeler. Wheeler holding the puck. Fires all over the next save. Oh my goodness! Quick got his leg out! That he slid across trying to fix didn't get it out. McDavid stops up. What a move! Shoots! Scores! Bench the call. And is the chance for him. What a save! Oh man! What a save! He had a wide, wide open, open net. net. Lundqvist was down on the ice. He reached back Tim. with it. He reached back. Campbell McKay, who tried to get a shot on goal. That was broken up. Here's Jack Studnika. Scores! Oh. Floated it in past Bobrovsky, who I don't think saw it. It's just a knuckler. Nothing on it. And it's in the net to make it 1-0 Vancouver. Now, did that hit Eric Stahl? It hit one of the Panthers on the way. Center. Motions to the bench for a change and heads there as McCann sends when he scores! Yeah. Martin thought he was going to dump it to the corner. I think McCann looked him off and put it on net. And Martin, who is heading to his left, beaten from outside the line. They tie it up 2 2. Two goals from the blue line. And the Wild answer the other way. Minnesota with a quick answer and they reclaim the lead. Second of the night for Ryan Hartman. Bennington has been victimized again by this wild attack. Well, Ryan Hart. Talbot out to play it. And they got it, gave it away. They score again.
Rasmussen cashes in on the giveaway. It's 4-2 Detroit. Thanks to the fine play of the Red Wings. And again, just building off of the momentum. Off and indeed, Nurse hops up and it's tipped in by Dreisaitl off a sublime feed from Evan Bouchard. 6-1 Edmonton. Domination has become decimation. In John December, as Kachuk brings this ahead. Kachuk scores! The captain created room to shoot and wristed it by Martin Jones to tie it at one. That's the way you turn it back around. Telling the Rangers a chance to clear. Look at Fox joining the rush on offense. Drops it off to Gauthier. In time, and the cutting score. Julian Gauthier after Adam Fox went deep and dropped it back. Rangers lead 2-0. Uh, there was a penalty upcoming to the Devils. And Gauthier, I don't know how he put this in, but it's a heck of a play once again. As he scores! The Oilers captain with the overtime winner! Offensive zone doesn't work, but watch this regroup. Beautiful little pass by Darnell Nurse. When McDavid matches it up, give him the puck. Moves in. Knocked away. Here's Zabanajad for Kraut. They score! Mika Zabanajad! It's a power play goal! And the game is tied 2-2! Two -two. That's his best pass of the season! Not a shot, a pass! You'll see the puck come. Paige Thompson with a step roaring in, goes behind the back, great pass! Follow up, they score! Thompson to tuck. It's 1-0 Buffalo. And did he ever tuck that in in a hurry? What a pass, though, by the big fella. Thompson spun it around and picked up his 25th helper of the season. What a play. Tremendous speed. Last game, some games you see him. He's into the physical department. Stolen by McCarr. Weaves his way in. Kale into the slot. Kale shoots and scores! You have got to be kidding me! That is absolutely unreal. Kale McCarr doing only things Kale McCarr can do. Puts the abs on top by a score of 3-2. to two. Last minute. Stretch pass. Now one-on-one. -on -one. Skinner against Soros. Skinner is in. He scores. <laughs> Jeff Skinner, predator killer over the years, picks up a breakaway goal with a good finish. But they turn it. Watch Thompson picks it up here. Look at the speed. He goes ahead for Leon Dreisaitl. Now McDavid to the net. Rich shot score. Connor McDavid makes his 26th birthday a celebratory one. His 15th power play goal of the year, 1-0. Good defending by the San Jose Sharks. Ferraro's had three or four excellent blocks in this one. And he just had one on McDavid before this puck was. Foodie looking to open the scoring here at Rogers Arena. And he fell down, and he still got a shot away, but put it wide. And that's going to make the highlight reels for a while. Sometimes you overthink things. And stays tall as Foodie has his out of the box he's taken down to the ice and then he'll try to play it to the slot tipped out front and they'll score oh Alex Tuck with the turnover and stayed with it and Buffalo's tied it at one it'll be a very teachable moment for Seth Jarvis is here in these consecutive shifts a bounce like that goal for Chicago Trying to match the Zuccarello goal. Bedard in. I never really got a shot away as Fleury poke checks it away. <laughs> Taylor Hall looking to tie it for Chicago. Poke check again and another trip by Fleury. The two referees are looking at each other. <laughs> oh, that was almost like an identical play there. After it again. Got to stick to Braden Point. It's front of Dan and blows out. Did you see that? Off Kucherov to keep it tied. A brilliant stop by Joseph Wall. Well, it's been a dominant effort by Colorado. Unbelievable wide open net for Devon Cage. Tic-tac-toe. What a beauty. And the abs do get.
get that third goal back. Perfetti across. Dylan has room. Shot. Zane Thompson. Rebound. And what a stop on Perfetti. Saved by Logan Thompson. A bunch here. The flurry in front. Look at the traffic. There's the first save. And wow. Logan Thompson sprawling to his left. Extends the pad, the stick, and it hits him. That kept all the momentum with the Devils. They've rattled off three more goals in a row. Matheson puts it and ends the streak. Michael Matheson got behind the Devil. Pajot, who was darting in the back door, plays it for Dobson. That shot stopped by Blackwood as toppling in was Wallstrom. It's a goal! It was put in by Beauvillier. Wallstrom was pushed into Blackwood. It's a 3 nothing lead for the Islanders, at least for now. Now they'll take a little look at it as the line. Fired around the boards by Shesterkin toward the net. They score! Sillinger. Shesterkin had vacated to play the puck. Sillinger. Olmark is going to try it, and he scores! Linus Olmark, the odds on Fezzinet. Just trying to kill as much time off. It went in! Oh my goodness! The goalie pulled. And uh, they're gonna clear Flurry's crease. They're gonna say he put snow in there. <laughs> I'm not sure. Eh? Like trying to stack the goal. Nice. Butler with it, right at center. Draw pass. Look out! a little bit earlier about Jason Spezza being that guy that comes up the ice in a little drop pass right between both into the corner Hagelin's pass off target all the way down and they score with the delayed call coming the Capitals throw one in their own net Kalen Addison well, and that's going to be a late call. Oh, I know. I was a late guy, too. I thought he went for a little bit of a flop. Now Jari goes down, takes out Dreisaitl. What's it, going on here? Had the collision at center. I think they're going to call two penalties here against Edmonton. The referee just pointed at Dreisaitl. He said, who, me? I think two penalties might be called against Edmonton here. Away beating his former teammate with Talbot at Edmonton. The head coach is Todd McClellan. Look out. The Kings come to the line. This puck takes a bounce in the corner, and I believe it was Justin Schultz that's in the corner, being around the board. Oh. 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 I would describe this for you, but we all just saw it. The Dukovic looking to bat it away himself. It's an own goal. Door plays it for Dobson. That shot stopped by Blackwood as toppling in was Wallstrom. It's a goal. Beauvillier, Wallstrom was pushed into Blackwood, and it's a 3 0 lead for the Islanders, at least for now. Now they'll take a little look at it as the linesman's talking to, I believe that's McCauley he's talking to, and we'll see what happens. Certainly, Lindy Ruff will look at it from his perspective. And... Referee was right there, had a great view of it. Fred Rebbins have turned pucks over with that quick pass up the ice. Perlini with a real good chance. Skinner missed play, a tap in. Dylan Larkin, the captain for the Wings, a gift. It's 3 0 Detroit. And there's that aggression again by the Red Wings, and Dylan Larkin with a point to the sky obviously had some personal issues he had to deal with. Well, this, this is big for the Penguins. They're, they're just trying to kill as much time off. It went in! Oh my goodness! The goalie pulled. Latang.